main motivation behind engineering is autonomous systems that we want to understand behavior, we want to understand how the brain works. For that we need to measure behavior. So we thought of tagging each individual to individual animals and then we could have groups of animals sitting together in one big cage and happily living there as a social group. And instead of taking individual animals and training them on performing little tasks, we then have a group of animals and each animal can decide when it wants to do a specific task and that's sort of at the heart of this autonomous system. The fact that each animal is tagged with a specific RFID chip allows us to monitor which animal is entering this conditional box. Additionally, it allows us to monitor exactly how much water is each animal drinking. It allows us to automatically weigh, the, weigh each animal. So in the event that fortunately hasn't happened so far, if an animal could get sick during these 18 months it's in there, we would immediately notice if, for example, its weight loss or that its behavior pattern has changed. Additionally, the fact that the animals are living in a group, living socially, means we work under minimal of any, any stress situations. So they're probably much less stressed than mice in, you know, that live in London in the tube. Um, so it is actually a group effort of not only the scientists, but the engineers as well as the staff in the biological research facilities. We as a team just won an award for animal welfare, the first Crick Award for three hours. In short, we hope that uh, it becomes a tool that many labs can use to study diverse questions that require precise, efficient behavioral analysis of animals.